We are going to Kamakura and Kyoto today, but before we do that, we're gonna eat at our favorite restaurant in Akasaka. This time we got the cold soba. so surreal. I think if they had tax here, I wouldn't have gotten the shoes, but they also had 10% off for members because it was grand opening. That was my justification because in Toronto, it would have been way more expensive. <sighs> These are the shoes I'm going to be wearing every day. <laughs> going to Arashiyama today to see the bamboo forest and we have a lunch reservation we're gonna see the monkeys I'm so excited to see the monkeys I think that's the part that I'm most excited about and then we're gonna walk, walk along the Arashiyama main street and hopefully we have time for the Sagano romantic train I feel like I'm not pronouncing these correctly thank you for bearing with me <laughs> <laughs> but we 
just finished the bamboo forest. It was very short, but it was still very beautiful. So if you're coming and you're expecting it to be long, don't. <laughs> it was like a three to five minute walk through the forest, depending on if you're taking pictures or videos. If you walk further and you make a left, there is this nice park. So we have lunch reservations, so we gotta go. Wow. This view is much better than the bamboo forest, in my opinion. It's so beautiful, you can see all the lush trees. There's these boats coming around, little boats over there. If you're just coming for the bamboo forest, please walk down more, make a left and then walk all the way down and there will be this beautiful Katsura, Katsura? Katsura River. There's another way to get to the river. I don't know how yet, but we just came from the bamboo forest and you can walk on the other side, I think. Really, really good. The matcha is strong. I didn't know there would be more stairs. I usually don't like cotton candy because it's so sweet, but this is really good. They had real matcha powder on this. Canada could never.
to the Tory gates today. Oh, it is hot. We're back down. We didn't actually go all the way to the top because it was too hot and we heard it wasn't that nice. So we're just gonna do other stuff today. But it was a nice experience. The Tory gates were bigger than I thought. It is extremely hot today compared to other days. On our way to lunch. Ah, look how pretty the clouds are. Philosopher's Path right now, and everything feels so serene and magical. It is quite a lengthy path, so if you're going in the summer, bring a hat and sunscreen and lots of water. But there is some shaded areas, like right now. I could see how pretty it would be during Golden Week with all the cherry blossoms around. We found a cute coffee shop to have an ice cold drink before we head to another destination. Even their iced tea is so good. We came back for our favorite donuts. Five colored bean donuts, organic strawberry, or oh, melted, and then the matcha. the best katsu ever. It was right there at the very back and it actually leads to this mall. It was the perfect flavor, the perfect crispiness. I don't know how to describe it. It was literally the best I've ever had. We might need to come back again. It was a little pricey though. We paid I think it was $30 Canadian for one meal, but that one meal was very filling. There is a refill for the cabbage, the rice, and the miso soup, which was also the best miso soup I've had too. It had like tofu, other veggies in it. Overall, such a good restaurant. I really recommend.
It's such a clear moon. Just walked along the Kama River. It's so worth going to. It's so beautiful at night. There's restaurants on the riverside and we caught it on a really beautiful night. The moon was out, there were stars, and it was very bright out. I love Japan. Look how pretty. I'm gonna tell you that I love you 100 times a day. We missed breakfast but that's okay because some restaurants open at 11 anyways i guess we're getting lunch because it's 12. Passing by the bridge from last night to go to a matcha shop. It is also very hot today. Need a shade. Oh, it's a little dark, but we are deciding on a place to eat right now. We are gonna go to Engine Ramen, but it's really busy and they close at nine and it's already 7.30. And they said it would be at least a 45 minute wait. So looking at other options, 